guys, Justin with Kayak Catfish. One of the topics I get asked about most frequently is rod holders. And for me and the type of fishing that I do, rod holders are arguably the most important piece of equipment I have installed on my kayak. So in today's video, I'm going to go over the style of rod holder that I use. I'm going to show you how I have them mounted to my kayak. And then I'm going to talk about the advantages and disadvantages of using this type of rod holder. Now, the brand I use is Scotty. I've been using these things for years. I've caught thousands of fish on them, including hundreds of trophy size fish. These things have held up incredibly well. And guys, when I say I've been using these rod holders, I mean it. My kayak here is two years old, but I took these off my old kayak, which I'd been using for six years prior to that. So these specific rod holders here are eight years old and they're still going strong. That's one of the questions that I get frequently asked is, am I worried about them breaking or am I worried about the plastic weakening over time? And I'm not, guys, I'm not. If something was gonna go wrong, it would have happened within this past eight years that I've been using them. So I have no complaints. Now, if there was gonna be a failure with your rod holder, it's most likely going to occur at the base. Now they make adapters for these that allow you to mount them on gear tracks. And that's great depending on the type of fish that you're targeting. For me personally, I prefer the 241 model base. With this base, it allows me to mount it directly to my kayak using four bolts. And I use stainless steel bolts, so I don't have any kind of rust or corrosion issues. But having it mounted directly to my kayak just gives me the peace of mind and security to know that when a big fish loads up my rod, and guys, these big catfish, 60, 70, 80 pounds, they can put a lot of torque on your rod. Having that bolted directly to my kayak, it just gives me that security to know that my rod holder isn't going anywhere. Now let's talk about the advantages and disadvantages of these. The big advantage is they're fully adjustable. You can easily position them in any position you want. You can also easily change the angle of the rod holder. That's important for a cat fisherman like me because one day I may be anchor fishing, the next day drifting, the next day trolling, and depending on what technique I'm using that day, that's going to determine what position and what angle I want to set these at. So having that flexibility is very important to me. Now my absolute favorite feature of these rod holders is the fact that I can very quickly and very easily remove them with one hand. That comes into play when I'm landing a big fish. If I've got a 50, 60 pound fish at the side of the kayak that I'm trying to bring in, these rod holders get in the way. And so it's very important to me to be able to very quickly and easily remove it with one hand. As for the disadvantages to these rod holders, really there's only one, but unfortunately it's a big one. And that is depending on what type of rod you use, you may not be able to fit it in here. A lot of these catfish rods currently on the market have this huge butt end on the end of them. Those rods won't work with these. Now me personally, I use ugly sticks as my catfish rods. I have no problem whatsoever fitting them in here. They, they work perfectly, but like I said, a rod with a big butt end isn't gonna work with this style. Now, recently I published an article on my website, kayakcatfish.com, where I go over all the brands currently on the market and I list the advantages and disadvantages to each of those. So if you're somebody who won't be able to utilize this style of rod holder, check out that article, which I'll have a link to in the description below. That'll help you make an informed decision and choose the rod holder that's gonna be best suited to your needs and your style of fishing. Overall though, guys, you won't find a better rod holder for the money. I looked this morning just to see what the current prices are. Amazon currently has these for $17 and change. That includes the rod holder and the 241 model base. The next closest price was $19.99. So if you're gonna buy them, buy them off Amazon, save yourself a couple bucks. I'll put that Amazon link there in the description below for you. But uh, you know, again, guys, like I said earlier, rod holders are arguably the most important piece of equipment I have on my kayak. I rely on these heavily and I need to be able to trust them when a big fish takes the bait. I have the utmost confidence in these. I've been using these specific rod holders for eight years. I intend on using them for hopefully another eight years. And I think if you're looking for a good rod holder, you can't go wrong with these. So hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.